finally. Hi everyone and welcome back to another vlog. My name's Christy. I'm Josh. And today we are taking you guys on a week in our life. We have Luna in the back right here. We're super excited. We wanted to vlog because this is the last week of August and... She's so cute. <laughs> She's too intense. It's the last week of August and we also are going to be doing a whole bunch of back to school prep. So we wanted to take you guys along for the ride. Right Luna? Luna's just excited because whenever we're on car rides she usually gets something. Well, that's a more than Timbit, like a plain one, or a Starbucks cup cup. <laughs> yeah, I know. She knows it's Timbit. <laughs> or camping, or hiking, or you know, there's always been something good, so she's excited. She's excited. But yeah, so right now, it's Wednesday. I already kind of have been vlogging Monday and Tuesday, but we didn't full on like vlog vlog. So we're starting up the vlog today on Wednesday. Before we start really vlogging the rest of the week, let me just take you guys back to Monday and Tuesday and as well as this morning and show you guys a little bit of lab content and what I've been doing last week of summer and how it's been for like the last week of summer. So roll back that clip. present day. Josh and I are heading out right now to go to grab some Tim Hortons. We're gonna grab a small ice cap for the both of us because we're craving it. And just for reference, it's about 7.30 at night. I just finished work. She just came back from work. Mm -hmm. And we're just gonna see where the day kind of like takes us as well as where the rest of the week takes us. Really not sure, you know, well we do have an idea of like what we're gonna be doing for like the rest of this week, but we just really wanted to take you guys along for the journey. So kind of like this will be a combination of a whole bunch of random clips so if this vlog feels random that's probably why <laughs> but i wanted to really show you guys what the last week of summer looks like before we start school officially next week tuesday exciting stuff to come Camera. so we just got our ice caps two small ice caps to kind of finish the night off i'm so excited okay guys so we are currently heading to ikea but we came back while well, we had school and stuff like that but we went to the nespresso store and we ended up making a pretty big purchase for the both of us um but we're converting into i guess like not really converting but it's more of an addition to our coffee bar area yeah we bought you know, see, see what stuff we got we got a lot we got yeah a lot. but it was like a lot deal, so 40 percent off mm -hmm. free free welcome purchase free item and then a bunch of other stuff so yeah so we'll do a like haul later when we get home but we're heading to ikea because i think we're gonna do a huge like office room makeover we will show you guys the haul later but yeah we're gonna be like nespresso nespresso gurus nespresso gurus now <laughs> what we bought 
damage we've done. The damage we've done. Honestly, all of it's on sale, but still. We're gonna rearrange this whole area, but I'll talk to you tomorrow. Stay tuned for the secret update. Hey guys, so we left everyone on a little cliffhanger last night in the last clip. We did buy again a whole bunch of stuff to build a coffee bar station in our office. And so today is a day where we finally just got back from work. We're gonna set it up in this corner here, but coffee bar area is gonna be right over here. So we're just gonna start and rearrange the entire room. I'm excited. So basically my job in this room is to simply bring the couch over and build a coffee table. And then I'll have Christine basically arrange the cart while I hand her stuff. She has a full vision for it. I do too. We've been shopping together, but she's the eye when it comes to designing. Okay, let's get started. Okay, seen the fridge in the corner here so now it's back to its rightful glory the whole idea is we're gonna put our milk or drinks and anything that's like basically our dairy products for our coffee two giant boxes Josh built the cabinet. So yeah, I finished it. Well yeah, I'm pretty happy with the result. Ooh, this is what it looks like guys. This is kind of the, the style or aesthetic that we're going for. And two sets of glass shelves and two sets of wooden shelves. And so a lot of space for us to put a whole bunch of stuff in there. We're going to be decorating it tonight and tomorrow. I'll give you guys a more in-depth tour tomorrow, but just an overview of so far what it looks like. We bought home Nespresso set. We got the Nespresso Vertero Pop machine in coconut white. And then we also got the Nespresso Arosini 3 milk frother. Yeah, so essentially this is their third model. Right now they have a fourth model as well for what we need it for. Third model works great. It has, I think it's a short press for hot beverages and a long press for cold beverages. And then now we got the big boy, Vertero Pop. This one's in coconut white. And then we got recycling bags because you gotta recycle your pods. Yeah, so one of the cool things about Nespresso that I like, at least, is I, I obviously I drive a hybrid vehicle, but I like to try and at least give it a little bit back. Basically, they have their own recycling program and also they put most of their money towards it, like basically going back to rainforest and stuff like that. Kudos to Nespresso. The machine you buy, you get a free discovery set kit. And so this is our Welcome to Nespresso discovery set. It's kind of like what it comes with. So if you guys do get one, this is. I don't think this is going to be the same for everybody, but this is what we got. Good way for us to try different pods. We could definitely go to the boutique and try their pods, but this is a good way to like do it at home. Ooh. Oh my gosh. These are the pods. <laughs> it's so fancy. Right? Yeah, so one of the cool things about the Nespresso shop is that you buy them into sleeves of 10. So basically whatever drink you want to try, you can get at least a tester first. Buy a drink. Mm -hmm. See how it is. Well, it's free drinks, so yeah. First rows for espressos, double espresso in the second row, and then coffees in the last row. So that's pretty cool. Yeah. When you first sign up in the first year or two, you get this like welcome package deal. And so you spend 100 or 150 capsules and you get free stuff with that. And so we did buy 150 capsules because we did go to the boutique and try the coffees there. And so we had a selection of what we wanted. So the Bianco, 
Tapio. We're gonna butcher these names, so like don't judge us for it. But next one we got was Alto Umbrado. This is the one of the coffee that I tried in the store. It's one of the number one hits they have. Mellow Zio. <laughs> <laughs> They're basically long shots or Americanos. I like them a lot because it's easy in the morning, so you feel like it's doing black coffee. We also tried one sweet vanilla on the recommendation of one of the workers there. Okay, we also got the Voltesso. Another popular one that everyone swears, but Bone Caramel. Again, I don't remember which ones are long shots, double shot espressos, but basically the way you can tell, small out of pod, more concentrated espresso it has, the larger the pod, probably more of like a long coffee is. And then the majority of pods that we got, Dolce, basically we have a whole box, we got some free gifts. So we got four cups, like I'm not going to be able to show you all of them, but we did got four of them, but this is what they look like. Ooh, they have the Nespresso logo. We also got a free tote bag. It's an espresso tote bag. This is what it looks like. That's so funny. And that's basically all we got from the Nespresso Boutique itself. We're gonna go set this up and we're gonna decorate this. Time to use an espresso because it's morning now. This is all the ice the machine made yesterday. That's a double shot of espresso. Mm, it smells so good. Yeah, so if you guys have the ice chicken espresso, this is pretty much what I'm making. Just a hot version. Oh, it's a bit. <gasps> you can make a heart. Yeah. So we're gonna go like this, I think. What is it? First cup of coffee. Don't lie. That's hot, but it's really good. I can actually. Yeah, it tastes like vanilla latte. So I put brown sugar. So I'm adding ice. Okay, this is, and then try mine. This is mine, brown sugar, okay, same okay. thing. It's just milk and coffee. Mine's a little bit better. You like that one? Okay, then make Josh this. Hey guys, so I just did a whole bunch of like stuff, errands in the morning. Josh is at work now, so he left after you saw that clip of us, you know, making coffee and trying the Nespresso. However, I got a package because I ordered this yesterday. One second, I'm gonna go grab it. Hmm? Yeah, because I got a package unbox with me. First box is the plastic cups and Liz. I believe this is the 100 set 24 ounce. <gasps> this is perfect! So this is what the cups look like. This is gonna be for like ice drinks, whereas we got the other one from Costco for hot drinks, but so this is what the lids look like. Just throw this on top. Has um, an insert for the straw. Second package, this is a 300 giant plastic straw. I know, don't comment on the environment. If you hear a lot of noise in the background, like a whirring noise, it's because of the ice machine. It's constantly making ice. 
I got a, another French vanilla Taromi branded syrup because Josh and I love to kind of add French vanilla or vanilla flavor to our milk to make lattes. And so this definitely needed, we needed another one. I also ordered the vanilla bean. These are all sugar-free. So we have sugar-free French vanilla, sugar-free vanilla bean. That's basically the quick haul. I'm gonna quickly decorate the cart and add the addition of the plastic cups. So I don't know if this is gonna be a for sure placement. Basically, we just have these two bins in the back and this bottle I got from Ikea a long time ago just for decor. Luna's treats are actually in here. Then we have the plastic cups, the paper cups, plastic cup lids, and then lids for the paper cups. This is a situation. fully dressed now and I'm just about to do my makeup quickly and put some sunscreen on just because we're doing like an outdoors event. For those who have watched the vlog this beginning or just have watched the vlogs consistently, you guys know my friend Bonnie. So it's her birthday. So her birthday's tomorrow, but she's doing all of her birthday like celebrations today. We are gonna do our makeup quickly and head out the door. I will chit chat with you guys in a little bit when I pick up Josh, Will, and as well as like when we're actually at the event. Okay. So finally heading out now. I'm gonna go pick up our friend Will. And then we're gonna pick up Josh from work and then head straight to the party. But I'm so excited to show you guys like what we're doing today and just like for you to meet like everyone there. It's gonna be so fun. I'm looking forward to celebrating Bonnie's birthday. So, you know, just spending time together. Okay, see you guys there. So my inspiration yeah. for today was using but a butterfly. Like the, I completely overestimated this uh, project to be what I thought was going to be pretty simple, but it takes a lot of pain, a lot of practice, a lot of focus, and I had none of that. So, well, it's not too bad. <laughs> Look at that chocolate donut with uh, sprinkles. Everyone knows that's a classic right there. Nice. Oh yeah. gym so we're just trying out like the espresso machine because we were making coffee for will as well okay, this is like yeah, a caramel will. frap from second cup which is usually where we get our like coffees from yeah so, so we do like a little quick carousel of caramel on the outside i got a full shot of espresso here we go that looks so good i wanted to hop on here and end the vlog just because we've been filming for last week of august and like we did a little bit of back to school prep primarily building this coffee machine was our back to school <laughs> prep there's really not much else that's gonna be going on it's monday september 2nd and we are basically wrapping things up for this vlog and we hope you enjoyed watching this and kind of seeing a little bit of our life throughout this week if you like this vlog don't forget to please like comment and subscribe and we will see you guys next week tuesday at 4 p.m bye <clears throat> bye <gasps>